Hello, it's Mark from The Home Reviewer, and today we are looking at this laptop over here. This is the Acer Chromebook 314, and I've basically, I've just taken it out with a box, and this is everything that comes inside of it, okay? So we have got our power cable, we have got the adapter over here, we've got instructions, and obviously the manual as well. So I'll put those two aside. Now, let's have a look at the actual laptop. Now this one here is, as you can see, it is in silver and it looks pretty good. Let me turn this around. So the actual display is 14 inch. So let's lift this up right here and I'll move it down here for you so you can see this. In fact, let me just move this back a bit. There we go. So this is, oh, there we go. Lift that up there for you. So let's take this protective cover off down here. So let's power it up and see how quick this actually loads up. Now, the reason why I went ahead and picked this laptop over here, we looked at some different reviews online for this. This one says, in terms of the, well, the screen is 14 inch full HD. It's plenty of storage comes with this. So it's got 128 gigabyte of storage, which, you know, it should be absolutely fine for my son because we've just bought this for him doing his, you know, his homework and his learning and things. So is it going to power on or is it not going to power on? Maybe I need to go ahead and very quickly and plug this in for you. So I'll very quickly undo the cable here and we'll see just how quick this loads up. Because obviously this model here is running on, it's not running on your traditional networks and things. This is obviously, it's a Chromebook, so it's running on the Google software. So let me just quickly plug this in over here for you <clears throat> and then hopefully... I can show you what it looks like and how it goes because in terms of the battery on this model over here it says the battery lasts for up to 12 and a half hours from a single charge it says you can use it all day without worrying about it you know turning off or running out of power so 12 and a half hours sounds pretty good to say the least so we're just going to plug the power in now down here Oh, also, I'll just mention to you as well, over on the side here, we've got a USB port down here. This is obviously where our charger goes in, so we'll just plug that in. Have we got another USB? Yeah, we've got another USB over on this side, and also an SD card slot, and we've got our headphone jack as well. So let's just put that down, and let's power this thing up. Or attempt to power it up. There we go, so it's loading up. And it says as well, the best of Google says this, Chrome OS combines simplicity, speed and security, plus millions of your favourite apps from the Play Store. So pretty straightforward. And also the price of it is ridiculous. So we went ahead and paid, let me just check this for you. We paid £229 for this. So that's what, about $240 for this actual model as well. Do you want to activate Chromebox, the built-in screen reader for Chrome OS? If so, press the space bar. Oh, no, press the space Chromebox bar. Spoken. Welcome to Chromebox. Chromebox spoken feedback is ready. Welcome to the Chromebox tutorial. To exit this tutorial at any time, press the escape key on the top left corner of the keyboard. To turn off Chromebox, hold Control and Alt, and press C. When you're ready, use the space bar to move to the next lesson. I think we'll just exit out of this, to be honest with you, so let's just exit. Exit tutorial button. Okay, so let's... Press search plus space to activate. Chrome, welcome. Connect to network. So Dialogue. basically now, Connect I've just got... Connect to network to restore your data. Connect to the... Blimey. Let <laughs> me just get rid of that. So yeah, I've got to obviously go ahead and connect this over to a network. Okay, so we've now gone ahead and got this connected up to the internet. Now, when when you first start on this, we get this here, welcome to your Chromebook. And it basically just walks through, you know, how to get this started, managing your files, organizing all your apps and lock screen. And if you scroll a bit further down here, you've got other things on here as well. Okay, lots of different stuff on here, but it's basically, it just walks you through setting up your laptop. Then what we have down here is we have all of the Google apps. So we've got the Chrome um, browser here. So I'll quickly show you this. So let's see how quick it loads. So let's just click on here and see. So I've just clicked on that website and it's starting to open up now. So you can see, you know, it works relatively okay for the price. You know, it's not going to be blazing fast, is it? But 
for the price point and you know um, just doing simple tasks like you know browsing the internet watching youtube and other bits it works very well then obviously down here we have got our files we've got youtube gmail documents another youtube tab we've got the play store and then you can you can sync this up to your phone so you can get messages on here as well and then you've got your notification bar along here so this is where you can find out all the other stuff so if i click on here you can see we've got all of this on here if we download anything it will all appear on here so yeah that is today's video but overall for a chromebook with four gig memory and also an eight hour battery life i don't think you can go far too wrong you know with this acer google chromebook so yeah that's enough for today's video i'll see you in the next one